This video is brought to you by StoneAgeGamer.com, a fantastic site for retro games, systems, accessories, and more. Be sure to check out StoneAgeGamer.com. Skip it up and that up. This story is a doozy. Hold on to your seats, folks, because god damn. A woman was arrested on bestiality charges after looking for horses to do things with on Craigslist. Here we go. First off, shout out to YouTube channel Secular Talk. He's actually partnered with the Young Turks Network. He has a great progressive news channel. I'll have a link to his channel below in the description. Anyway, back to this story. An Arizona woman has been arrested on bestiality charges after trying to arrange sex with a horse on Craigslist. The woman who is transgender and who the police report is legally known as Donald Wade she's 22, posted this ad on the misconnections section of Phoenix Craigslist on April the 8th. This is what her ad said verbatim. I'm not making anything up here. I am 22 years old and want to play with a male horse. Simple as that. If you have access to a male horse and can allow me access to a male horse, then contact me, please. I will do something in return. Oh boy. So someone reported her ad and police got wind of this, the Maricopa County Sheriff's Office and undercover deputies contacted Wade. I think I'm saying her last name right. During a subsequent conversation, she allegedly stated she wanted to perform oral sex on the horse and agreed to meet the undercover detective. The meeting took place on Tuesday and deputies brought along a horse from the sheriff's mounted posse as a prop to tempt the woman. During the meeting, Wade Wade allegedly admitted to placing the ad and her sexual intentions with the animal. She was arrested and charged with conspiracy to commit bestiality. Okay, first and foremost here, here is the very obvious question I'm sure a lot of you are asking yourselves as you listen to this video. There are billions of very horny human beings on the planet. Why? Do you need to stick your schlong or blow an animal? I, I just cannot fathom. I'm in my horniest hour. Couldn't fathom, man. I really want to get laid. I wonder what my dog is doing upstairs. Like, I just don't understand why you can't stick to your own species. There's actually a vice documentary. Okay. Where they went to Colombia because the men there and boys like to have sex with donkeys. I shit you not. I'll put a link to that documentary in the description. It's real. And you're probably thinking, oh, Rich, that's their culture. No, even the women there are like, we don't get it. There's plenty of horny women here. Like they actually interviewed two women and they said, we don't get it. There's why you'd want to sleep with an animal. There's plenty of women here. It's really weird. I, I just don't understand it. Like I, I would be, I couldn't even get a boner to attempt doing that. Whatever, I mean, I guess everyone has their fetish, but me, I'll just take hot cougars. Not the animals, the women, the, the older women with big boobs. I, I have a weakness for them, but moving on from that. But that's like my extent, man. I would, you wouldn't see me like, man, let me go see what those goats are doing. I'd love to plow one of them. Whatever. Now, this is where the tech part of this comes in, because I know when I do stories like this from time to time, which isn't often, a lot of you say, oh, he's just doing this for views. This has nothing to do with technology, but it does. Think about it. What would Donald have done if he was around in 1978 and he had a horse cock craving? <laughs> what would he have? A horse cock convention in his backyard? What would he do? Sneak into some guy's barn or ranch or whatever and start sucking off a horse? <laughs> like, what would have happened? That's the thing, man. The internet just brings out the weirdness in people because it's so convenient. And like I've said in a video or two before, people forget, okay, you're sitting there with a boner because you want to have a horse cock in your mouth. And you think, ah, no one else is seeing me. No one could see what I'm doing. Ah, type up an ad and, you know, it goes into Neverland. No, other real people can see that ad. I mean, I'm sure like subconsciously she realized this, but she wasn't thinking like, yeah, just because you are in front of your computer, it's as public as if you were in Grand Central Station with the sign up saying, want a horse cock in my mouth? 
Come give me one! It just, you gotta think. You have to remember just cause you're in front of a damn computer screen doesn't mean what you're doing is private. Also too, you friggin' weirdos with this bestiality fetish, stay away from animals, man. There's plenty of consenting adults out there. Why do you need to do this to an animal who has no idea what you're doing? They don't know what's going on. They can't say yes or no. Stay the hell away from them. Stick to your own damn species. If you're into bestiality and this offends you, then you're a weirdo. Sorry, <laughs> I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna try to be nice to you. You're a fucking weirdo if you get off on doing something to an animal. Ugh. All right, folks. Make sure to rate, comment, favorite, and subscribe. And if you have an interesting news story you would like me to discuss, private message me with a link via YouTube. And if I use your news article, I will give you a shout out in the video and feature your YouTube channel in the description. Have a good one.